for people who are looking for summarized ideas, just quick inspiration in the morning, they might be on something like Instagram. It's quick, you look through the pictures, you understand. Short captions, okay? Something like Twitter is even shorter. But look, if you're really looking to make a campaign, you actually have to have at least all three of these platforms, and I'll tell you why, okay? Instagram is actually really great for raising awareness. Okay, it's really great for raising awareness to pique people's interest because you can use a visual. You know, people go to Instagram because they just want to look at an image and understand. Okay, so this is where you grab people's attention through images. And then maybe you have a caption that says something about that image. And then on the bottom it says, if you want to know more, go to my Facebook. Ah, and then it's in your Facebook that you elaborate more information. Okay, because the users on Instagram are not going to be the same as the users on Facebook. Now for Twitter, Twitter is a place for discussion. You know, you get your point across in small bites so that you're able to say, you know, what do you think about this? And then this person will say, this person will say, you can choose which ones to, you know, interact with. So this is where you go to discuss and this is why a lot of people really love Twitter. You know, because they can go there and, you know, ask questions and discuss things with people who knows who, you know, and also a lot of, you can see a lot of businesses are on Twitter and that's how they do their customer service, you know, because people have to keep their question or complaint very short and they can be addressed right away.